Hello my fellow smug ones. Well this better not happen. Let's begin. Okay, this story is from the Daily Express and it says Tony Blair's car tax proposals will go down like a lead balloon and hit drivers hard. The former Prime Minister has called for a new road pricing structure that will charge drivers each time they use the roads. Mr Blair said a new pay-by-mile approach was once in a century opportunity and would deal with the social costs of driving and probably also cost the same amount as, I don't know, I'm guessing a house maybe. If you drive or commute a lot of miles a year, that is. And also, how would this even be policed? Would they simply trust us to fill a form in stating how many miles we've covered in that year? Or would we probably also have to install a telematics box in our cards, which would not only give them the amount of miles we've covered, but also, as far as I'm aware, our location too. Anyway, however, experts at Fair Fuel UK have attacked the proposals, warning the updates would hit the economy hard. Instead, they have called for the Tony Blair Institute to call for the 2030 petrol and diesel car ban to be scrapped. Oh, that reminds me actually, I went in an electric car the other day for the very first time. My brother took me out in one that he had for a test drive and I've got to say, it was actually a lot better than I was expecting. Because not only was it nice and quiet, but also the acceleration was like nothing I'd experienced before. Yeah, apart from in an airplane that is. Don't get me wrong, obviously we didn't break the speed limit or anything like that, but when he put his foot down, my eyeballs and actually my entire face were left in the back seat whilst I was in the front. Although personally, I think the 2030 date will probably be put back anyway because whilst improvements are obviously being made, as far as the range the cars can go before needing to be recharged and the time it obviously takes to recharge them, I don't think we're anywhere near yet. Although yes, they're obviously still nine years to go, but they just don't seem to have come very far in the previous nine years, have they? Anyway, going back to his silly, in my opinion, idea that is, I'm not sure implementing an idea from one of the apparently most hated politicians in history would be such a good idea in itself. So to be honest, I can't really see it happening. But then again, I could be completely wrong. What do you think? YouTube's algorithm thinks you'd like to see one of these videos next. So let me know if it's right.